So now I'm back to running the dead cat. I want to see how my voice is getting picked up, especially walking in front of the camera. And compared to the back side of the camera, I'm not sure how well you can hear right now. So I'm going to swap it over to the to face me. And now I think my voice should sound a little bit clearer now. It's not very windy right now, but I want to see if it's picking up any wind noise using the dead cat. It's not as breezy as it was when I was using the foam filter. So let's see how it's picking up my voice now. Getting a nice background blur. So I'm wondering if I change the aperture, if it's going to make a big difference for the rear. If, let's say if I want to showcase the back. I'm not sure if you can see the car back there. Focused on the car. Focused on me. I'm a bit surprised about how the CPO lens is making a really big difference when I don't have it pointed directly with the sun on my back. This is with some more moderate lighting. Let's see if I can get a shot of the hot air balloon in the background. So this lens that I'm using is a Viltrox 13mm f1.4. Now this lens doesn't have any sort of, uh, any sort of uh, stabilization in it compared to the Nikkor 16 by 16 to 50 millimeter, 3.5 to 5.6. So wondering if this is picking up any sort of vibrations from when I'm walking, for example. I'm going to do a quick test to see what it looks like when I'm running with this one. Curious to see how that looked just now. Felt a little funny running around with the gimbal <coughs> in the middle of the park. Luckily there's nobody else around. So I was able to park the car that way. There we go.